हाय गाइस वेलकम और वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल होप यू ऑल आर फाइन एंड डूइंग गुड सो हेयर इज अनदर लेट नाइट स्टडी ब्लॉग एंड आई एम स्टार्टिंग दिस वीडियो बाय मेकिंग अ कप ऑफ ब्लैक कॉफी इट्स लाइक व्हेन एवर आई यूज्ड टू स्टडी इन द नाइट आई यूज्ड टू हैव अ कप ऑफ ब्लैक कॉफी इट मेक्स मी फील एनर्जेटिक by having a cup of black coffee i really don't feel sleepy and so yeah so it's around 180 days left for the exam and so oh, it's time to be serious it's time to you know study a bit harder give it a push like if you study 5 hours a day start increasing your sitting hours because it's very very important it's around Six month left for the exam, and uh, if you are having backlog, just clear it up and get started with the things. Like so many of you were asking me how you are covering your backlog, so mine was quite a different. <laughs> But I can suggest you what you can do is that first and very important thing is that don't miss the live lectures if you are having backlog. Like it was when you started missing your live lectures with the backlog. you started making your own schedule it just messed up don't do this it was quite a wrong thing you know you feel like uh, you cannot watch the live lecture as the chapters are connected with previous chapters but it's not it's not like that you can complete it if you give it a you no know, effort just simply what you can do is that like if i talk about chemistry if you have backlogs in physical chemistry you can start with inorganic chemistry and meanwhile every day you can give like one hour to your physical chemistry and you can easily cover it in a month i guess like i am also having backlogs in physical chemistry so this is what i am going to do like start covering the inorganic wala part and then i'll meanwhile i will be covering physical chemistry every day and uh, like in biology i am not watching pw's lecture i am just simply watching one shot of dr kram and mani because i want to complete my biology syllabus like uh before january so for that i am doing this and yeah so all in all what i want to say you guys is that uh, don't miss the live lectures if you are having backlog don't miss it you know keep watching your live lectures and keep clearing your backlog both at the same time and you can it's not like you just wake up and start doing your backlog no please don't do this just wake up watch your live lectures you know figure it out if you have a doubt in the live lecture or not if you having like you are not able to clear with the things you, you should watch the lecture again mostly it's happened like for the first time you might think that you are not able to understand the lecture but if you go through the same lecture second time most of the things will be cleared and it still things are not clear you can use philo app if you don't know about philo philo is an online tutoring app it has like more than 3000 tutors and it's a 24/7 live tutoring app like you can ask your dad any time like early in the morning or late night tutors are available there and it's like you are not bound with anything you can ask any question any topic anything like even you can ask like your career related problems you can ask the teacher you know you know uh, you can ask a question and then after that you can ask the teacher that you are facing this problem can you help me they'll surely help you teachers are very polite and very genuine so you can check out the philo app link is in the description box and right now i'm starting with physical chemistry and for the revision of physical chemistry i am watching like pw khazana lecture i have bought pw khazana like during the during i was buying the batch but i was not watching the lectures so i decided for the revision i will be watching khazana lectures so right now i'm watching rithik sir's mole concept like in five lecture sir has covered mole concept in five lecture and it was very detailed sir had covered all the question and sir clearly says that you know each and everything will be included in this lecture like you don't need to go anywhere so it's like if you have already covered your team bath lectures you can just come and watch you know pw because on a lecture and you are good to go and even if you are not able to cover all the lectures of your team bath you can just simply watch the khazana lecture and everything will be sorted like your topic will be you know your chapter will be covered 
it's not like it's still in the backup you can cancel that chapter from the backup list and if you have extra time you can watch the looking back lectures it's like this uh, like it's for those who have pw khazana if you don't have pw khazana it's okay you can just continue with your looking back lectures or one more thing is that you can watch these lectures on telegram channel like there's so many telegram channels people provide all of these lectures for free matlab i don't know why they do this like they give it a lot of efforts but they do it and it's like it's a nice thing i have seen so many uh, you know groups of yakeen 2.0 batch 3.0 batch even i was thinking about to you know have a look at yakeen fast track course how the teachers are teaching as i have already uh, you know uh, learned physical chemistry from fasil sir when i joined apni kaksha last year uh, yes last year i guess i joined the drona batch but so many backlogs and i won't be able to continue with that so fasil sir is a very nice teacher so i thought of you know have a look at fasil sir's lecture om sir is a very nice teacher i have seen their videos on youtube of apni kaksha uh, the, uh, he had recorded some you know animated videos so both the teachers are very nice i'm not joining the batch i'm not buying the batch i did not buy the batch it just that it feels like have a look so i so uh, simply search on telegram and i found you know so many groups and they were uploading lectures so it's nice if you can if you want to you know have a look at other batch or other teachers you can just go on telegram and yeah and another important thing while covering your backlog is that don't forget to you know practice questions on your backlog chapters it's like we feel like we are having backlog we just simply watch our lectures and go ahead we really don't practice questions or we don't focus on practicing the questions like we most of the time we skip the uh, question slide during the lecture we skip it we feel like we learn the content we learn the theory part and we were good to go but it's completely wrong if you don't practice the question you will you know not get the things that did the concept is clear are you able to you know grasp the concept you will like you were done and you go ahead but later on when you give the test you started realizing that you don't know anything you don't remember anything you don't have that practical knowledge that how to apply this concept so it's very very important to practice questions on each and every topic you cover so don't you know forget to solve the dpps dpps are very very important so i basically f- focus on covering the lecture and like covering all the concept and then covering the dpp of pw so it's like these days i am doing two subjects a day like i will be covering like biology is my everyday like i told you guys in so many of my videos that i am doing one day one chapter of biology and it's going like going perfectly fine like till now i'm able to cover the chapters in one day but uh, i know that there are some chapters who are quite lengthy and it takes time so i will be giving it two days uh, but till now it's going you know good so one day one chapter for biology and like for some days it was chemistry for some days it was physics and uh, revision is very important every time you cover a chapter don't forget to revise it in future like i have covered mole concept earlier and i was not revising it so i thought of you know give it a revision so that's why i was covering mole concept today and i thought of revising all the chapters i have covered earlier like till now i have covered uh, like uh, six chapters in physics and uh, like almost six chapters in biology so i will be revising it uh like i need a plan that i am going to you know figure out how to make it like i will write it somewhere that i have learned mole concept on like monday so i have to revise it on sunday and it's like that or you know i was not getting time every day to revise them so i was trying to plan it you can recommend me something like how to plan my revision and always plan your revision like so yeah this was all about these things and so many of you guys used to told me that 
you know you cannot understand hindi so that's why i am trying my best to speak english and um yeah so at the end conclusion of the video is keep revising always you know whenever you are clearing your backlog always watch live lectures and then clear lo- keep, uh, keep clearing your backlog otherwise you have a bulk of backlog you know you have a mountain of backlog and you will end up doing nothing you will keep procrastinating i already have been gone through over all of these things so i am suggesting you as being you know the second dropper third attempt student and please you know keep these things in mind because you know these things happen with me when i have lots of backlog i leave the batch so don't do these things uh, you know catch up with the live lectures as fast as you can as soon as you can and keep revise and keep clearing you clearing your backlog slowly slowly like giving it you have to give extra time until unless you clear your backlog like if you used to study 10 hours a day it was really needed to you know study 12 hours 13 hours a day so that you can cover your backlog asap so yeah this was all about today's vlog i hope you enjoyed and if you did do like comment share and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching goodbye